In this video, YouTube custom video speed. From desktop, I'm on Windows, if you click the settings and you've got playback speed for number one, at number two, click on the word custom. Of course, you can select um, like clickable speeds, but on custom, it opens up a bar which slides this white slider. It opens up, of course, on normal speed. What you get, and why I'm making this video, is that if you tap the down arrow or the left arrow, you can go down in steps of a 20th of speed, in other words, 0 0.05. 15 taps gets you down to 0.25. Tapping to the right or up on the keyboard, 20 taps gets you to double speed. This is super important if you want to save a ton of time by listening to, say, a talk, an interview, a press conference, you name it, a how-to video even like this, to make use of your time. The faster you can do it, the more you can understand, the more time you save. Now, if you did say that you looked at the regular YouTube shortcuts, you can decrease the playback rate and increase it by the left and right arrow or shift, comma, shift, dot. However, when you do, do this, it means that you can only go up in 0.25 at a time, which is the regular one, not the custom one by regular keyboard. With me so far? Back in the day, when I made another video in October 18, you could only control the slowing down and the speeding up like this. For me personally, 1.6 was really useful because I could listen to a speaker, understand it and save time. So for example, a 10 minute talk, I could get through at six minutes, 15 seconds, saving me more or less about four minutes. You do the math because if you can actually listen faster, you can save your time and do something else with your time. If you go to mobile or tablet, I'm afraid you only get the clickable normal to 0.25 up to 2. So there's not so much um, customization. In summary, we have 1 settings, playback, 2 custom, 3 slide with your mouse or tap the arrows. That was it. Good luck working from home and be productive.